we get this video started, I have a challenge for you guys. If you are not already subscribed, you have five seconds to do so. Ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Did you do it? Hit your thumbs up if you did it and comment down below. I'm a smelly bellion. What's up guys? It is Smelly Belly TV. My name is Tara, in case you're new to the channel. We've been getting lots and lots of new Smelly Belly to the channel. So I just still want to do our intro and I kind of feel weird if I don't officially like introduce myself even though a lot of you already know me and if you are new we call you guys our smelly belly ends because it's smelly belly tv and as you can see it's a pretty rainy day out today um we're in the car right now we just came to have some family time and eat at one of our favorite places to go all right this is the true test if you know smelly belly where are we where are we it's been our most recent place to come and we come like at least once a week sometimes twice a week it's just uh, Ada, Rory, Jesse, uh, myself, Jayla's not here, she will be later. She meets with a small girls group uh, every Wednesday and today's Wednesday for us, so that's where she is. She's off hanging out, having some girl time. So we're gonna go inside and eat because we just got done working out and I am starving. My body needs food. By the way, check out my snazzy new leggings. What do you guys think? A straight up lemon, let's see it. How is it? How do you do that without Mommy. making a face? Mommy, I have a lemon. Rory, of course, has. Oh, look at the face. Ada made a face. <laughs> it's sour. That's a lot to eat. All right, let's see Rory. Go for it, bro. Go, Rory. Do it. She wants to be just like her big sister. Yo, How is it? Yeah, oh. Do you like it? Thumbs up. <laughs> Rory, are you eating the whole thing now? Ada took the ceiling like off. It. How is it? Are you gonna eat it all? She's afraid to bite into it. She wants to, but she's a little afraid of the, uh, the aftermath. Ada's so silly, guys. They're playing outside. Look at how sweet Ada's being. She's being such a good big sister. She's so ready to play outside. I just wanna say I'm so thankful for my big girls, Jayla and Ada because they are just such great role models for Rory. Of course, they teach her lots of silly, silly things as well that sometimes I don't Sandra like. Gillette. I don't like, but it's okay. They're just trying to be good big sisters and good role models. And it's just so nice that Jesse and I get to sit here and hang out for a little bit for a few minutes. Yeah. And we don't have to worry about Rory. It is nice. Because Ada's got it under control, guys. She is like the ultimate babysitter, I will say. Mm -hmm. She loves babysitting. And I wanted to just real quickly tell you guys too that sorry I haven't been as energetic. I've been like sick for like the last It's like five four days, days now, yeah. Four, four or five, five days. days. So sorry I haven't been bringing the energy as much. Tara's really helped out a lot with taking over the vlog. I, I usually participate more, but I haven't been because I just don't feel good. The girls just got back from outside and look at Ada Bear's back. She's getting wet. It started to rain out there. Were you Rory, in the what, rain? What, what did you do? Oh, you want to show oh, me the yeah. back too? <laughs> All right, there you go. Did you have fun out there? It was scary to run very hard and there was a little skeleton. There were skeletons out there? Yeah. This rainy day has inspired me to go back to my childhood. When we get home, guys, we are making mud pies. Have any of you ever made a mud pie? Okay, I will say some, an embarrassing story, a super quick story about myself. Fun fact about Tara. When I was little, I made a mud pie and my friend and I actually tasted it. Because I thought it would taste like chocolate. Like how silly of me is that? To think that mud is going to taste like chocolate. But when you're a kid, like your mind, it's just crazy. It's crazy mind. So we're gonna go home and do mud pies soon. Are you guys excited for mud pies? Yeah. Ada, have you ever made a mud pie? No. You're eight years old and you've never made a mud pie. What kind of life have you been living? A terrible life. Just kidding. Rory, should we make mud pies at home? Yeah. And jump in muddy puddles? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go do it. Are you ready to go make mud pies? Yeah. Ada is scoping out the mud situation. 
By the way, I'm very, very proud of my giant cactus that I was able to grow. Just like it. It's grown cactus. nice and big. Yeah, cactus. Oh. Who's ready to make some mud pie? <laughs> we have our mud pie pants. We have our utensils. Let's get digging. The best thing ever in life is making a mud pie. Well, one of the best things as a kid. You have to make a mud pie at least once in your life, and you guys are getting wet, so I'm trying to shield you as best I can because we do not want our camera frying out on us because that already happened once. Shovel Dad to the rescue with a giant that. pile of mud. Rory, look at it. It's called for a mud pie. They go. <laughs> <laughs> It is a true mud pie now. Give me some wet stuff. <laughs> I have the girls a nice covered workspace here. We put some tarp over our table. So now it's mud pie making time. <laughs> oh my. Oh my. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> All right, come on in. <laughs> and a little bit of a yeah, we have your mud. And uh, Jayla says that she's not going to be participating. I don't blame her. I'll be here to watch she's the experience, here to watch. but I'm not going to be nasty because I just took a shower this morning. <laughs> what do you think, Ro? I think it's yummy. It's yummy? I think Is it awesome? Look what I found. Oh, you found something in there? <laughs> wanted to give the girls something that I had experienced as a child, but I am regretting my decision at the moment because look at this mess. Look at this mess! And we still have mud cupcakes to make. Actually, they're muddy muffins. Muddy muffins. Let's get to it. want to participate however we have a very special guest who is willing do you guys know who it is we have our good friend John here and John always has wanted to have a mustache and a goatee and so he has agreed to participate in uh, the art of mud so we're gonna go ahead are you ready John John have you always wanted a mustache I don't know name what you dab I don't dab You do the walrus, right? You've seen the walrus in the past. What, what is that one? Being the artist that I am, I'm gonna give you one of the most amazing beards to give you that look that you've been looking for. Please do not lick my finger, John. That makes me very uncomfortable. All right. So we kind of want a mustache that curls up a little bit. <laughs> and we really want to give John the goatee look he's always been looking for, which is kind of a V shape like this. All right. John, you're done. Go ahead and look, John. What do you think? John is out. John, where are you going, John? John's going back John, to his homeland. Back. He's going back to his homeland. That's the preserve, John. I really, really hope John is going to clean stop. up all this mess because I don't want to deal with this. Yeah. Of course I will. John, you're back. He didn't leave us after all. What'd you say? John, no. No, John. Stay with us. Stay with us. He's dabbing out, guys. He is dabbing out. Rory, do you know how to pocket? Do you know how to pock the mud? Oh, look at this, it's ultra satisfying. Guys, she's pocking it. Look at it. It's like she's making a poke cake. Rory, are you pocking? Are you pocking? Yeah. I'm getting my clothes muddy. Are you getting your clothes muddy? Oh, you like getting your clothes <laughs> muddy? Oh, I can get muddy. Yeah. I told the girls that they had to get on old clothes to get muddy, so now Rory thinks that means she should just rub her clothes in the mud. 
It's not quite what I meant. It was more of like, if you accidentally get mud in your clothing, then it won't matter. But she took it as, let's just get covered in mud. And this is Rory's first ever, ever, ever mud pie. Right, Rory? Yeah. And Ada too. I didn't realize that I had never played mud pies with Ada. What type of mom am I? How could I even be called a mom? I haven't even played mud pies with my kids yet. Ada is a mud snob. She will not take mulchy mud, but the best mud is hiding under all of our mulch. So it's kind of inevitable that you're going to get some mulchy mud, okay? Show me that smile. Show me that mud smile. Show me a muddy smile. How do you make your smile muddy? Can you? Can you make your smile muddy? <gasps> She's gonna do it, guys. She's gonna do it. She's gonna do it. Ah! Oh, she did it. Jesse is so proud because he said he has created yeah. mud stew. Would you guys eat that? Mud stew right here. Would you guys eat See, mud stew? You add the mulch to it to make it extra stewy, and then there's dirt at, or mud at the bottom. If you guys ever meet Jesse in person and he offers you mud stew, do not eat it. Just say no, kids. Just say no to mud stew, okay? It's not good for you. Watermelon, that is good for you. If he offers you watermelon, take it. Not mud stew. What do you have? Mud, a giant glob of it, and it's getting all over my cushion. We are gonna have to hose this entire patio down, huh? It's a mess. Only the finest of muds for my Ada bear. Glitter mud. Glitter mud. I have a story about how that, oh, fail. <laughs> the reason why our yard has glitter in it was a long, long time ago, we did a little challenge called the fairy challenge, and we threw glitter filled balloons off of our roof and they popped everywhere and uh, there's still glitter in our yard guys you know glitter is like the hardest thing to get rid of that was months and months and months ago and it's still there that was like a year ago a year ago Jayla yeah. thinks it was a year ago you know what i'm gonna put a card and you guys click and then tell me was it a year ago yes or no you look like you've been having way too oh. much fun sir I actually am just enjoying having this time with my kids because... Isn't it fun? Yeah, I remember... <laughs> and John. And uh, I just remember, like, doing this as a kid, running out, yeah. you know, probably not Jayla's age, but um, no. eight 9 to age. 10. Whenever I, was, whenever I was, like, 6 or 5, we were about to leave to, like, this fancy, like, dinner, and I was literally rolling in the mud. Like, I got my hands in the mud, and, like, it was all under my nails, and Mommy was like, Jayla, we're about to leave! <laughs> yours is a chocolate? Yeah. And yours is what, Ada? Vanilla. Vanilla? Kind of lighter. Rory, give the bellions a bite. Give them a bite. They want a bite of the worm, too. Yeah, they like the worms. Oh, goodness. Rory Kate. Wait. Are you being naughty? What is that handprint? <gasps> no! Naughty! No, 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 no. no. There will be no more mud pie making if you do that. Miss Ma'am. I need to take a bath with clothes. You need to take a bath now? Yeah, I need my clothes. Are you done with your mud? Yeah. Thank you guys so much for making mud pies with us today. We had a blast and I'm glad that my kids got to experience this. Even though, yes, it is a pain for me to have to clean it up when well, Jesse as well, it's gonna be teamwork. But you know what? They're gonna remember that time someday in their future when mom let them make mud pies in the house and it's gonna be a pretty special time. So I had a lot of fun doing it. But it is that time of the day to say our favorite parts of the day because that is the Smelly Belly TV way, Jayla. Oh, favorite parts of the day? Yeah. My favorite part of the day was definitely seeing John. Seeing John. How, how did you see John? Where, how did you see him? I was, um, I'm, I went to John's house again and I saw him running home. Oh, so she saw John running over to come hang out with us. Okay, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. My favorite part of the day, honestly, today, guys, was... My whole entire day was my favorite part. We got to go hang out as a family at lunch. We got to make mud pies all together. Everything was just amazing today. I cannot choose just one part of the day. My favorite part of the day was making mud pies with Rory. Okay, what was your favorite part of the day? My favorite part of the day was getting muddy. Getting muddy yeah. is like the best day ever, huh? I'm a bad girl. You're a bad girl? Are you being naughty today? No. <laughs> My favorite part of the day was just letting the kids be kids and making a mess. I think that every kid needs that in their life. Rory, what are you doing? You're giving her a mud bath? Oh my gosh, guys, I think this has gone from bad to worse. The would you rather for the day is would you rather eat one of their mud pies or a real chocolate pie? Leave it down in the comments below.
Thank you guys so much for watching Smelly Belly TV today. And remember, we put out new videos every single day at 6 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So hit your thumbs up and that subscribe button. Ada is going to do the ultimate taste test. Are you ready, Ada? Three. This is her choice, by the way. She Two. wanted to do this. One. Five. You. Do it for the vibe. Do for the vibe. <laughs> Do for the vibe. Okay, let's see it. Let's see your face. <laughs> oh, that is not chocolate, guys. That is mud. You want to do it? Yeah, let's take all the worms. Okay, take out all the worms. Okay, that's good. Two. Can I get a towel? Go, Rory, go. Do for the vibe. <laughs> Do for the vibe. Okay, take it out. Take it. <laughs> Click up here to see yesterday's video. Click up there to see more vlogs. Click up there to subscribe and also click over there if you're feeling spicy. Also check out our you, you Now, Musical.ly, and Instagram. You can always find us under Smelly Belly TV. As always, eat your pickles, kids.